because there's like literally no one here. Like no one. It's so only about a 30 minute flight to Munich. kitchen and lots of closet space here there's so much space in this room I love it there's a lot of seating all my stuff I just threw right there I love this little area over here and the views are absolutely stunning it's really hard to see because I have the lights on in here but the view is incredible and you can see the Ferris wheel down there and I can't wait to see what it looks like in the morning I see all the trains go by and there's just so much space. There's a nice big mirror here for me, which I love these kind of mirrors when I'm getting ready. And the bathroom is super nice too. I really like this hotel. So I highly recommend. Good morning from Adina Hotels in Munich, Germany. Got my mimosa. Today is my 26th birthday. And check out this view. So gorgeous. I got my little pretzels for breakfast. I'm so excited. My second day in Germany and I was terrible terrible at vlogging yesterday so I promise I'm gonna be better today and show you guys more of the city but I'm really loving it I'm gonna go grab some breakfast I'm at Adina Hotel and their breakfast was amazing I grabbed it real quick yesterday so I'm gonna go show you guys Of course, the view from the hotel is stunning. I am at Marion Plots. Marion Plots. Plots. With my friend Clay. He is living here in Germany. So he came and met me in Munich so that we can hang out. And we're waiting for what's it called? The Glockenspiel up here goes off. It's supposed to go off at 11. You got a minute. Yeah, it's a minute till, so we're gonna see. It's kinda cool, but it's so cute. It's Sunday morning, so it's not as crowded as it was yesterday. I was trying to get pictures and videos here and it was just like super chaotic. So, if you're gonna come here, come on a Sunday morning. I, I, get, I can record it too, I guess. I'll put it on Snapchat though. It's giving me like haunted doll vibes. <laughs> It reminds me of It's a Small World at Disney World. Oh, no. Got our coffee and gonna wander around today and then try to go to this really beautiful palace. It's a little bit outside of town. <laughs> Firmland, because 
but it looks like Wormland. Wormland. It's just so interesting. <laughs> You've got mm -hmm. some food. It looks really good. I love this stuff, whatever it's called. I think it's called Spetz. She said Spetz, like Spetz. This food is so good. I love it. I gotta figure out what it's called so I can put it in here, but it's amazing. What do you think? It's pretty good. <laughs> she can't be shy. Good. This, this is what we got here. It's so good. I have a really hard time reading and pronouncing German. I don't understand it at all. Oh, we're waiting for our Uber and it's literally hailing. I don't know if you can, let me see if you can turn my- What? Oh, whoa. <laughs> that is massive. Yeah, they hit me in the head. Okay, we finally got an Uber. Just got so cold. But we're on our way to the palace. So it's inside and I couldn't buy tickets online so hopefully we can get in. Welcome to Germany. I told you okay. to Missouri. <laughs> we made it to it's Nymphenburg Palace. And it literally I'm like it's the temperature's just dropping like crazy and it's literally snowing. It's Sunday, May 29th. It's snowing. Oh, look how beautiful. Just gotta get inside, but it's a little bit of a walk, which I didn't know. I thought we could be dropped off at the front, but no. It's okay, we're out here living. Okay, first of all, this is so stunning. Let me put it in point five. It's so gorgeous. Like, I would love to take photos out here. It's so beautiful, but unfortunately, it's just too cold for that, and rainy, and snowing, and hailing. So I'm back in the hotel now. It is kind of stormy outside and I have a 6 a.m. train to Vienna tomorrow, which I'm very excited about. So make sure you subscribe so you can see that trip. I'll be going to three countries while I'm there doing some day trips and I'm really excited. I'm doing a solo trip there, but I'm just kind of chilling since I have such an early train and going through all of my pictures. But overall, I really loved Munich. It was really cute. Um, the food was really good. And also, side note about Germany, there's a lot of really attractive people here. Like, everyone was just super attractive in general. Um, <laughs> just a note. But I did really enjoy it. The weather was super bipolar. I don't know if that's normal here, but it was, like, really beautiful day yesterday beautiful day this morning and then it was raining and then snowing and then hailing and storming I don't know it's like really crazy but I had an amazing time here and make sure you subscribe so you can see the rest of my trip for 26 for 26 this is country number 23 out of 26 for my 26th birthday so I just realized there's an actual washing machine in this hotel like <laughs> This is amazing, especially because my trip may be another week or two longer. 
so now i can last longer this is amazing hey guys it's 5 a.m i look weird because i have my hoodie over my skims dress but i'm headed to the train station to go on my way to vienna it's such a pretty sunrise the sun rises so early here and sets super late Okay, no worries. I made it to my gate in time. I got another Uber and conveniently there's a Starbucks right here. I love seeing the difference in product at food chains in other countries. It's just so interesting how different it is. They have this, pretzels. <laughs> 